Well, if you have not been to downtown Ocala recently, you might be surprised by some of the recent changes there. A new hotel opened in the downtown square just last month, and now the city is shifting from traffic lights to stop signs. Several of those lights were removed today. And new at 5.30, News 6's Crystal Moyer explains the details behind the city's decision. If you're traveling through downtown Ocala, be prepared to stop. The digital signs warning drivers while utility crews removed 10 traffic signals in the area, most along North Magnolia Avenue that run through the Ocala Square. Ocala spokesperson Ashley Dobbs says engineers with the city conducted a traffic study that ended in October. And what was determined is that the traffic flow on the side streets, the volume was so low that it just didn't warrant having traffic signals. So crews are removing the traffic lights and creating four-way stops with stop signs. These flashing lights temporarily installed to remind drivers to yield to pedestrians. While the city says the decision was made to make the downtown area more pedestrian friendly, some people think the holiday season wasn't the best time to make the change. Notably, four-way stops, people don't always pay attention to who gets there first. With the more traffic and the more congestion, I think it, especially since people are going to be walking with the new Christmas lights up, I think it might be a little bit uh, dangerous. Others say they are already seeing improvements on the road. The traffic flows better and when people come here into the square they're not in a big hurry so I don't think it's a safety issue I think people are more than happy to allow the pedestrians to proceed as part of the project the city also reduced a part of Magnolia Avenue from two to one lane adding extra on-street parking the city wants drivers and pedestrians to be more vigilant downtown until they get familiar with the new traffic patterns those lights are activated and will be flashing for the next three months before they are removed. In Ocala, Crystal Moyer, Getting Results, News 6.